Okay guys, so today I'm going to demonstrate the difference between a rigged claw machine, which will be the one on the right, and a non-rigged claw machine, which will be the one on the left. The one on the right will be rigged for harder play and less chance to win. The one on the left will be rigged pretty much to win every time. So let's get started. Alright, so this is the one that is rigged for harder play, harder to win. So we'll start by trying to grab something. Nothing. Let's try again. Alright, got one. Now, let's see how many more we can get on hard mode. Two. Let's see. Oh, stop short. So as you can see, it's kind of geared to let you win less as opposed to one that is geared toward letting you win more. It stops short sometimes. The claw strength is adjusted to be looser so that it can't grab as easily. We'll now move on to the easier claw machine. Okay, so this is the one that's geared to be easier to win. So we'll go ahead and try to win something here. Claw strength is great on this one. Got that one. Try again. Go for the turtle. Now this one will grab something even if it's not at an optimal angle, even if it's a hard grab, the claw strength is such that it will grab it anyway. And pretty much every time you try you're going to win something. And that's how I prefer it honestly. It's funner that way, some people like more of a challenge. As you can see, this one's a lot easier than this one has been. Alright, so I wanted to go over how we get the claw machine to be rigged to be harder to play. So we're going to open this right here. We're going to go in to where the controls are. And we're going to press this round red button. There are the settings. So, we can go to Claw Voltage. Now, if we want it to be on Easy Mode, the voltage will be on 24. Then, that's the Maximum, Minimum. So we can choose the Minimum to make it harder. Low Voltage, Maximum, Minimum. We'll do 1. Alright, we can do Voltage Height. 8 seconds, that's the maximum. 0 seconds. Let's do 2 seconds. Low voltage method. Top. We'll try top. Alright, return. Now, prize setup. Win rate. Win rate can be every 5 wins, every 1 win. Let's do every 10, and that just makes it so that it's easier every 10 tries to win a prize. So we'll go back to return. Claw resets itself. Put this back in place. Alright. Now let's try. We'll go for the yellow bear. No go. Pretty much the claw is not doing anything that I ask it to do at this point. So that's what those controls do to the play of the machine. One more time. Nothing. And you, a lot of times you'll see that in our case. The claw will kind of grab and then let go and then come up. So that's how you know that it's rigged against you. 
All right, so those are pretty much the differences between a rake claw machine like the one on the right and a non-rake claw machine like the one on the left. And if you see any of the patterns like the one on the right has uh, in a real arcade, you'll know that the claw machine is probably rigged against you and you're not going to have a very good chance of winning, which is why it's great to have a home arcade if you are able, of course, and to have one that's set and on an easier mode so that you can just have fun winning so i hope this has been a little bit instructional on how to spot a rig claw machine and how to operate your own claw machine if you have one thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time